everyone. Welcome to day four of the November Turn Inward Journal Challenge. As you know, today's prompt is all about receiving. What would you like to receive more in your life? Interpret that however you'd like. And if you've taken time to journal, that's great. If not, make sure you get to it after this flow. So today's flow will be all about helping us open our hearts and being willing to receive those things that we've always wanted or that we want in this moment that we want this year um, so as always go ahead and get yourself into an easy seat place your hands on your knees and begin to sit up nice and tall beginning to stretch the crown of your head just a little higher and rooting the base of your spine into the ground even further Slowly begin to bring attention to your breath. Notice how you receive the inhales and release the exhales. Inhale, begin to receive. Exhale, release. Five more rounds of breath here. And inhaling, sipping everything in, breathing all the way into that low belly. And when you exhale, slowly letting everything go. Three more rounds of breath here. Big inhale and exhale. Inhale, slowly begin to bring those arms up overhead and exhale, begin to cactus your arms, open the chest, open the heart, open the throat. Bring the gaze up towards the sky, the ceiling, wherever you are. Imagine you're seeing those clouds. Stay here for two more breaths, just squeezing those shoulder blades together. And inhale, bring the arms up, bring the gaze forward. Exhale, cactus. Inhale, arms are up, gaze is forward. Exhale, cactus. Inhale, arms are up, gaze is forward. Exhale, cactus. Inhale, arms are up, gaze is forward. Exhale, begin to twist to your right. Right hand coming to the base of the spine as you push up through the heart, keeping it open. Gaze falling over that right shoulder. Take two long inhales and exhales here. And then inhale, sweep those arms up through center. Reach tall. Exhale, twisting to our left this time. Left hand coming to the base of your spine, right hand to the outside of that left knee. Gaze falls over the left shoulder. Just knowing that one side might feel a little different than the other, and that's okay. Continue reaching through the crown of the head. Open the heart, big inhale. Exhale. Inhale, both arms come up. Exhale, twisting to our right. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale, twisting to our left. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale to the right once more. Inhale, arms up, reach tall. Exhale, twist to your left. And then inhale, arms come high. Exhale, start to fold forward. Now I'm gonna go ahead and get myself into a position so that you all can see me from the side. So reaching up tall, inhale, exhale, fold forward. Begin to shake your head, yes. Yes, I'd like to invite in things that I know I deserve receiving. And no, I'm not inviting in things that I don't want. 
just shaking your head yes and no a couple more times here and then walk your hands over to the right side of the mat bringing the left hand on top of the right reaching through that left side body breathing to those left ribs one more big inhale and exhale inhale those hands come through the middle exhale bring them over to the left side of your mat left hand on top of the right same thing here breathing into that right side body maybe trying to get that right shoulder to come a little closer to the ground rooting into the ground with that right hip one more big inhale one more big exhale inhale those hands come through center bring them to the right once more left hand on top of the right one round of breath here inhale the hands come through center exhale bring them to the left one round of breath here and then go ahead and unstack your hands make tense with your hands so like this so you're like you're picking up some cups off the ground and we're going to slowly drag our hands to the right and then drag our hands to the left allowing that outside of the shoulder to guide you so inhaling and exhaling just letting the neck hang heavy one more time back and forth and then inhale meet me in the center reach long exhale walk those hands back up sit up nice and tall reach the arms up overhead and then exhale bring them down to your knees again sitting up tall and on our next inhale, we're going to start to move our chest to the right as we then slowly come forward, opening the heart, receiving here. Exhale, curve the spine, come backwards. Inhale, coming forward, receive. Exhale, check in with yourself. What do you need? One more time, this direction. Inhale. Exhale, start in the other direction. Inhale, coming forward exhale move back inhale exhale one more time inhale exhale meet me in the center take a big inhale arms come up overhead exhale bring them to the mat slowly untuck those feet bring them back behind you come into a tabletop position Go ahead and tap those feet out for a moment. And then get yourself into a nice tabletop position. Palms under the shoulders, knees under the hips. Inhale, begin to drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, curve the spine. Inhale, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Open the heart, receive. Exhale, check in with yourself. What do you need? Inhale, drop the belly, lift the gaze, receive exhale release one more time inhale drop the belly lift the gaze and exhale curve the spine inhale meet me in the center and then exhale tuck those toes under lift your hips meet me in a downward facing dog so stay here for a moment walk out your dog just bending one knee and then the other maybe switching your tail back and forth One more round of breath here. Big inhale and exhale. On your next inhale, reach that right foot up overhead. And then exhale, slowly begin to step it through, coming in between your two hands here. Staying here for a moment in this high lunge. And then slowly lower that left knee down to the ground, untuck the back foot, lift the arms up high, inhale. Exhale, cactus, begin to receive. Stay here for a moment, lean into that left hip. And then inhale, arms come up. Exhale, sweep them back behind you. Inhale, bring the arms all the way up into cactus, receive. Exhale, sweep them back. Inhale, one more time, find that cactus. 
and then exhale, bring them back. Inhale, arms come up overhead, lean into that left hip. Exhale, bring the hands down, tuck the back toe under, straighten the front leg, lean forward. Now go ahead and spin that back foot so that it's down on the ground, maybe walking it in a little bit like I just did. I'm trying to get those hips in alignment here. Just coming into a little pyramid pose. Just think about checking in with yourself. What do you need to receive? What would you like to receive? One more breath here. And then slowly begin to bend that front knee as you drop the left knee again. Sweep the arms up overhead, cactus. Exhale, bring the hands down, straighten the leg. Inhale, drop the knee, sweep the arms up high, cactus, receive. Exhale, pyramid pose. Inhale, one more time, sweep the arms on up, cactus. And exhale, bring the hands down to the ground, step the right foot back to meet the left. And if you'd like to flow through a vinyasa right now, now is your time. Eating back in a down dog. Two breaths here, we'll move to the same thing the other side before we round out our practice. On your next inhale, begin to lift that left foot up overhead. Exhale, begin to step it up in between your two hands, staying here for a moment. And then slowly lower that right knee down to the ground really leaning into the right hip. Sweep the arms up high, big inhale. And then exhale, open the chest. Bring the gaze up high, open the heart, cactus. Staying here for two breaths. And inhale, arms come up. Exhale, straighten the front leg as you sweep those hands back behind you. Inhale, arms are high, cactus. Exhale, sweep them back, straighten the front leg, lean forward. Inhale, arms come up, cactus. Exhale, bring them back, lean forward. Inhale, one more time, cactus, lean into it. Exhale, hands come back. <sighs> Inhale, arms come up straight this time, lean into that right hip. And then exhale, bring those hands down to the mat. Tuck that back toe under, straighten the front leg, maybe walk the back foot in a little bit, coming into your pyramid pose. Trying to get those hips to stay in alignment here, so not letting that right hip come too far behind you. Really working on trying to get it in alignment with the left. Stay here for two more breaths. Breathing into that outer left side of the left leg. And inhale, begin to bend that front knee as you drop the right knee down. Sweep the arms up overhead, cactus. Exhale, pyramid. Check in with yourself. Inhale, open on up. What do you need to receive? Exhale, check in. <sighs> inhale, one more time. Open the heart. And then exhale, come on down. <sighs> Inhale, drop that right knee, untuck the back toes, sweep the arms up overhead. Exhale, bring those hands back to the earth. Step the left foot back to meet the right. Flow through a vinyasa if you'd like. Meet me in a down dog. Then slowly drop both knees to the ground. Begin to walk your knees up to meet your wrists. Go ahead and cross those ankles behind you as you lower your bottom to the ground. I'm gonna face you all to finish out our practice. Sit up nice and tall. Take two more deep breaths here. Notice what's happening in your body. Is your heart moving faster? Are you breathing a little heavier? Are you feeling a little more open 
and ready to receive. I hope so. Inhale, reach the arms up overhead. Bring the palms to touch. Exhale, slowly lower. Pause at your third eye. Pausing here, reminding us to always have kind and loving thoughts and reminding us that what we think about is what we bring about. So if you believe you will receive love and kindness and light and all the things that you desire, then you will. So you can then give that love out to others. <laughs> Lower your palms to your heart center, reminding yourself to always have kind and loving intentions towards the self so you can give that love out to others. Go ahead and bow to yourself in gratitude. I like to end my practices with Om Shanti Shanti, as you know. So go forward, receive everything you deserve. Om Shanti Shanti. Thanks, everyone.